Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Henry and this is Rick. That's right. And uh, today we are taking a road trip. Uh, we are headed from Rancho Cucamonga to uh, San Diego. We are going to be doing uh, residential and commercial buildings uh, today. So in this video we're going to be uh, basically showing you guys how we go about uh, cleaning commercial buildings. This is going to be a rooftop, has hundreds of solar panels on it, and uh, we're going to take you a ride uh, with us today. All right, guys. Uh, we'll see you guys in a bit. Stay tuned. See ya. finally made it here to San Diego we're gonna be showing you guys the commercial building um, well not the building but the rooftop itself and show you uh, the steps that we go about cleaning this and getting it all set up so with that being said we will catch you guys uh, all right we are here in San Diego and we're pulling up uh, to this building and we're going to be doing the solar panels on top of this building right here so got Rick over here ready to go and uh, we'll be on top of this building cleaning some solar panels here in San Diego <music> These are the solar panels that need to be cleaned. And what we do is we do a visual inspection of all these panels. Want to make sure these are all good. And we inspect all of them just to make sure. I see one that's cracked already. Uh, this one right here is cracked and Let me see you probably can't tell you know unless you really really you look at it, but I'm going to show you some tail signs of a cracked um, Solar panel if you look on the corners of these We'll go ahead and inspect this one Look at the corners Nice and clean right? See this bead right here? This bead is nice and clean. Let's take a look at this one. So, gonna go ahead and get on these. But this one, look at the corners. See that? These are cracked. All the way. If you look at the bead on this one, you can see this one nice and clean this one cracked and we inspect every single one so I will take a look at all these pre-inspection this is what we're doing I'm doing the walk around I'm inspecting these doing a quick visual on them you have oxidation right here on these panels that's all going to come off with our brush and again I go through these really fast because been doing this a long time guys so I inspect every single one looking at them oxidation right here going through the inspection oh nice see a nice jet right here two of them well San Diego there you go Right here next to uh, Miramar, the 
base and so we're gonna get some of those jets flying by but again right now I'm just doing the visual inspection we're gonna go ahead and uh, uh, show you how we clean these panels with our uh, Solitech 1000 how fast we clean these things and so forth there's the crack panel right there you can see the difference we won't even waste our time cleaning that one but all the other ones around definitely going to do that so you see Rick over there getting ready he has his job he knows what he needs to do I have my job I know what I need to do and we work well together always work in a team guys if you uh, own a solar panel cleaning company always work with two guys I don't care what they say it's faster it's better you got each other's back and you'll never you'll you want to go home at the end of the night every single night so if you're on a roof like this and you fall and nobody's around well that could have been a difference between you surviving and you dying so those are harsh words but it's reality all these roughly are going to take us maybe an hour to clean this that's it and it's over 200 panels here let me get rick up here and we'll get started with that
we are taking a little break right now. Um, we did get these uh, mostly done. We're still working on them. Filling up our tank again, getting uh, the second 100 gallon tank. So to do 200 panels, roughly took us about 200 uh, gallons of water. And um, that's actually really, really good. It's all spot free, deionized water. They look great. Um, so we did them once already. We're going over them again just to make sure that we hit every single spot and we do that and then right after that we're going to take pictures and um, get that done yeah salute salute so let's finish up and uh, we'll see you guys in a bit look at that just like butter baby He's already on the second row on this one. Hey Rick, this one right here is cracked. Don't don't worry about this one. I'm gonna walk the length of this and you can hold it. I'll get you right now. I'll get you right now. So I'm gonna give him a little bit of hose here. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and time lapse this, but um, We'll probably be done with this in a short period of time. Just wanted to let you guys see how we work in the operation, how this is being done, and how he's handling it. So what he's doing, he's doing the first row and the second row, kind of just getting them both at the same time. And we told the customer we're gonna go over these three to four times just to get them clean. So be about an hour. And we are done. So let me tell you how we got this job. Um, we did, we, a customer called us, wanted their own personal house done. And uh, so we went ahead and we did theirs uh, up here in San Diego. And uh, so, you know, we, uh, uh, he asked us if we do commercial uh, accounts. We said, yes, we do. And uh, we set up all the paperwork, uh, insurance, all that good stuff got that sent to them as quickly as possible and we were able to uh, do the solar panel clean at the same time on this commercial building uh, that's just the luck that you get sometimes you know you just never know who uh, is going to um, have the bigger jobs and what have you so you know it could be a small job and then turn into a really big job and and those are the things you kind of have to look for so we tried to take as much work as possible try to take as much as we can um, you know and uh, once we do that then uh, eventually we start getting accounts like these you know and so this is an easy job guys this right here we can knock this out in no time at all because uh, they're flat they're up on the roof it's only like a 15 degree pitch on on these and we can go over these several several times so even you got a big guy like Rick man he can muscle that out fairly quickly and get it done pretty fast and with this brush right here uh, it's like butter you know it cleans these panels Cleans them really, really nice. As you can see, this one right here, pretty dirty. Watch when he gets a hold of it. See how nice and clean that is. And he's going over these really slow because they're oxid uh, oxidization. So he wants to get that, buff those out, get get some nice and clean. And so, there you go. You got the pro at work. Handling his business. I told him, you'll never get that hard hat dirty, Rick. Never. And he's proven me right. <laughs>